Hello boys and girls. For this week, you're going to draw your own pie. I'm going to teach you how to do this step by step. I'm going to draw in marker so you can see, but feel free to use pencil if you don't want to go right ahead with marker. Okay, the first shape we're going to make is going to be a curved line, kind of like a rainbow, the top of a rainbow. So watch me. I'm going to start here and go like that. Okay, we don't want it too high. Next, I'm going to close this line, but instead of going straight, I'm going to make a curved line like that. Next, I'm going to make a line on the left. Then I'm going to make a line coming down on the right. Then you're going to close this line by creating a wavy line. This is the crust of the pie. Now for the pan or the dish the pie goes in, I'm going to make a line here and then I'm going to make a line this way. So I'm going to start on the left. I'm going to make a line like that. And then on the right, I'm going to slant my line towards the center as well. Now this line at the bottom should be curved just like this line right here. So it should not be straight. It's going to curve a little. This will make your pie look more 3D. Next, details. There's always holes in the top of a pie so it doesn't explode in the oven, right? So we're going to make a teardrop shape in the middle. And then on the left, we're going to make a teardrop shape going off to the left. And then we're going to make another one going off to the right. Next, we're going to add a face because food is always more fun when you add a face on it. So I'm going to make a circle here and then a circle on the right side. These are going to be the eyes. Then I'm going to put another circle the top right and another circle in the top right corner here. Then I'll make a smaller circle on the bottom left. Then I'm going to color not the circles, but everything else black. Okay, next, I'm going to make a mouth. Make a slanted line like that. And I'm going to go like this. And I'm going to add a tongue. And I'm going to color not the tongue, but inside the mouth black. Okay, and there it is, adorable. If you want, you can add your own face. You can make your own details. You can add eyebrows. Your face can have glasses. It can be sad. The mouth can be happy. You never have to copy me. Maybe I'll add some smoke coming up because my pie is steaming. There we go. Okay, next, I want you to color in your pie using anything you have, crayons, colored pencils, maybe you only have markers, anything will do. And it's up to you. You can make your pie a fantasy color or you can make it realistic. You can make it look like real apple pie or pumpkin pie or blueberry pie. That's up to you. All right, if you know how, please take a picture and upload it to Google Classroom so I can see these. And I will see you next week. Bye.